All right, today we're going to talk about how I remove or move plants in my dirted tanks because it is quite difficult. It's one of the probably the worst thing about having a dirted tank is that it's hard to move stuff around because you got to be really careful about how you pull up the plant. Otherwise, you're going to break the cap of the gravel and there's going to be dirt flying everywhere. So you got to be cautious about that. You can really make a big mess if you don't do it right. So what I found is the best method is to uh, just take your time in general, especially if you know the plant has a lot of roots, like uh, something like the dwarf sage has a lot of roots, sends off a lot of runners. So a lot of these are attached together. If you already know that going into it. You're going to want to uh, grab the base, maybe move some of the gravel around. Slowly give it a little tug. You're going to notice some of the gravel lift up along with uh, maybe some, you'll see some dirt pop up, a few specks. Then you just want to wiggle it, let the gravel drop down again, press down on the gravel around it so the gravel uh, stays covering the dirt while you slowly pull up the roots. And there may be dirt attached to the roots when you pull it up. And that's sort of uh, just part of the deal. It's going to get some dirt into the water. So I recommend turning off any filters, power heads, air stones, anything moving the water in your tank uh, during this time when you're moving stuff. And I also recommend doing a water change at the same time or the same day as uh, when you're moving your plants around so plan accordingly and uh, it's gonna help reduce the mess because you will get dirt on the top of your gravel it's almost impossible not to unless you're uprooting something like uh, baby tears where there's uh, not a lot of roots like a large root ball now that Cryptosporalis had a really big root ball and there was uh, a point where dirt was starting to come up out of the gravel and it's always good to have some extra gravel along uh, with you that's out of the tank and uh, when you're moving stuff if you see that the cap is broken and the dirt is escaping you can just grab that real quick and throw it in the tank to cover up the hole in the, the cap so that's what I did and uh, it was a pretty simple process you just gotta take take your time slowly pull it out and uh, you know if you, if you leave some roots down in the gravel uh, as long as it's not a big root ball or something you're not gonna have many problems so if you can see that there's roots going everywhere and you're gonna just destroy the tank if you go any further just snip off the roots and call it a day so those are my tips thanks for watching